are tall people. Um, and yeah, because you cannot be here, I'm taking you along like this. And we're trying to find some lunch now. Lily, you need those. They are massive. Oh my god, that brownie. <gasps> These brownies are like bricks. tomatoes but they are so pretty Lily I can't decide what to eat everything looks so good but the crazy thing is if I want to I could come here every single weekend and try everything um, because I now live here and I can't believe how scared I was of moving here do you remember all those nights of me panicking and being so scared that I would not like it that I wouldn't enjoy it and now I'm loving every second of it <laughs> I love dumplings. I haven't decided it quite yet, but they look very, very nice. Hmm. Are you making video? Video, yeah. Uh, video costs 500, yeah? Oh, goodness. I don't think I have 500 pounds. Well, you have to find it. You can do a washing up for us, so it's going to be exactly the same money. Mac and macaroni and cheese and gambo, whatever gambo is. I decided on my food as well. I'm going for dumplings, you know, and obsessed with dumplings. Lily, I got fudge. I'm gonna send you some. Which one do you want? Salted caramel, I guess. Yeah, they've got salted caramel. Oh my goodness. For you, peanut butter rocky road. Oh, we're on the Millennium Bridge right now. That behind me is my favorite view. Um, the St. Paul's Cathedral is so pretty. Um, and really, tell me why exactly was I scared of moving here? Why did I think I would not enjoy myself? I'm loving it, I'm loving it so much and also I'm very sorry but I'm eating half of your fudge right now. You're still gonna get some. It's just so, so good, the salted caramel. You have to heat it on camera. Okay, it's a bit later now. I'm here with Oliver and Hi. because I talked about how much I'm enjoying myself in London, I thought we could share the funniest, best story um, I think that happened last week with you. It's amazing. So, yeah, we were sitting in Theatre Cafe. Oh, actually, I just got my drink. I was coming down to the table. We were not nowhere close to the window. And then suddenly it's like, I look outside and I don't even notice that um, Lottie's looking outside at the same time as me. And, <laughs> and I stand like, up and wait. I'm just like, hold up. And then I turn and, to Lottie. And I'm like, Eddie Redmayne? And so I was just like, Eddie Redmayne! And so literally we, and we just... we grabbed our phones, and we ran just sprinted outside. outside. We left all of our things behind. And just... the thing is, we were, we were not even looking out, outside the window. And there were lots of people outside the window. But somehow we both noticed that there was a familiar just looking for like a guy second. for a split second. We ran past him and we got him. And we got these two amazing pictures here. Um, with Eddie Redmayne <laughs> and no one else in Theatre Cafe noticed, no one else on the streets noticed. I got to say that like we love him as an actor and that he's amazing. <laughs> we got these photos! It's great, it's great. And when we got back to the Theatre Cafe everyone was like, what just happened? Why did you sprint out? <laughs> Who did you see? And after that we were the celebrities of the Theatre Cafe. Literally, people were like, can I take a picture of your phone? Can I take because, a picture of your like, picture <laughs> just to prove just to my because, friends? Like, people will believe me if I just say that people saw him. <laughs> yeah. No, that was that was so good. That was the best best thing that has happened here so far. One of the best things, and that had to be shared. We're so stagey too. <laughs> How did we even recognise him? Okay. But yeah, um, I think that's the end of the video. Um, I'm I'll stay here waiting for yours and see you next week.
Bye.